Hey, it's Tom from Tom, from Rick and Tom's views and opinions. You can tweet us at uh, Rick and Tom R I N C K N T O M S V I E U. You can tweet us at that with your ideas and stuff you want to hear about. This is one I gotta do. This is too fucking funny. All right, this guy. All right, are you ready for this? What about stupid, stupid. All right, he wanted. This is funny. I, I, it's tragic, but it's funny. But you got to follow me on this, okay? A guy is in Texas. He used to live in St. Louis. Unfortunately, that's where I'm from, too, St. Louis. Let's go, Missouri. Go Cardinals. All right, so this guy goes out in Texas. He's in a bar. He's drinking. All right? He's drinking. At 2.30 a.m., he decides he's going to go out and swim with the alligators. Him and his girlfriend goes out there, and there's signs posted. Alligator sighting. Do not go into the water. He says, screw the alligators. He announces, screw the alligators. Jumps in the water. Guess what? He got screwed by the alligators. The girl says, I seen him come up. He bobbled. He went down. He came up. He bobbled. He went down. He bobbled. He came up. He went down. Yeah, that's an alligator taking bites. <laughs> this is funny shit. Okay, now, the best part of this story is, this is a 400-pound alligator, 11 foot long. How do we know this? Because the next day, his hillbilly friend, who is also 28, named Bear, and if you look it up on the website, he's smoking a cigarette. He looks like Joe Dirt. He's... <laughs> He went to the bayou and illegally killed the said alligator because he killed my friend and the shit had to be revenged. And you just don't go around eating my friend without getting killed. So, shit had to be evened up. <laughs> That's why he killed his friend, killed his alligator. Unknown to him as a protective species and now he's charged with killing a wild endangered animal. <laughs> How stupid is stupid? You can't make this shit up.